I mean Rikin. I'm just going to follow this path. I don't know exactly where I'm going. I just know that uh, in this place it's just a start point for many many hiking trails. Uh, I let my uh, bike here. This is my new old bike. So this is my Landor's bike uh, which is more than 20 years old. Anyway, it works for me to do my things. Uh, I'm already tired because biking to this place took me a long and exhausting time. Not too long but exhausting, only uphill. Uh, and uh, now I'm gonna start going there. This is a nice place that uh, I'm coming from. And yeah, let's step forward. My hiking shoes are at home because uh, yesterday I wanted to do this trail and I came uh, kind of at the same time around 7 p.m. which is 7 p.m. right now very sunny but uh, just before arriving here a heavy storm started so I just had to hide myself from the storm for a while and then uh, I decided to go back so I'm using this one right now because the others are wet still at home because uh, I forgot <laughs> to put them outside to dry them out so oh that's a nice view cool probably a lot nicer from uh, up here yeah just a few meters after I found this nice view here will probably be a house soon as uh, there are many houses here and probably someone will uh, get this and I'm saying that because also there is this sign here so it's for sale till Sally uh, this Norwegian guy, Wakad Sharif, is uh, selling his uh, thing. Yeah, so it's probably a third party, or how do you call these guys? That? Yeah, because these things here are so expensive. Yeah, and uh, not so many people in Norway are selling their stuff by themselves and they just use companies for doing uh, everything, helping them with the legal stuff. I love these uh, big rocks I can find in my hikes. Okay, Gummeru Druntur, Druntur Bussop. Yeah, I already looked at the map and put uh, a pin on a place I want to go. It says uh, one hour of walking. Yeah, just through the forest, everything's nice. Birds are singing. And another viewpoint over this rock. Okay, big mistake from my side. I didn't look at the map and I thought because of the map said just straight. <laughs> I went straight but a bit to the right. <laughs> and yeah, I'm on the wrong road. But anyway, I found this thing which says Kikut, which I have no idea what that is. And it says 0 0.1 kilometers, so just 100 meters. So I will go this way, see if I can find that Kikut and maybe find out what the hell it is. And then I will just go back and continue on the road because if I continue this way I'm just going back. It's just a roundabout uh, to the same place and uh, yeah, that's too short. It's, uh, it was very exhausting because I only went uphill. So yeah. Birds.
So I guess this is the Kiku thing and I think it's worth it. Oh god. This is amazing, what? <laughs> That's Oslo Fjord. That's the fjord right there. You can see the horses from here, wow. Just to talk a little bit more about this place. So yeah, of course it's open for public to come here and enjoy. Uh, of course you are uh, safe from the rain because of this kind of building. People here has uh, had signed all over the place. You can see also. Stult, Bidrag, Sitter, Spare Bank. Okay, so it's uh, yeah, just an ad for a bank. Probably they sponsor this thing. So this one as well, very nice. There's also history here. Historian Om Kikut, Nitten Treti Sex, Nitten Oti Sex. Burger Sittaki could blow big it first is to Vernes Krieg and Gang Melum. Okay, then we're in total iter some till the Narison Blue Vertal. Your be Fral Medallen. So in the in the Second World War they destroyed uh I think Verdens Krieg and Gang Melum, yeah. Um and then they uh, created uh, 17 more, something like that. Not sure, they signed over here as well. So yeah, just come to this place, the fireplace grill. And enjoy, with friends. Very, very, very nice. <laughs> there are all the tools you need here, probably also a lot of uh, trash from trash people yeah it was raining uh, these days so there's still water in some places yeah but this is uh, very cool um you can do that during winter as well i think that's very very nice this place is a bit dirty, so I managed to get on the main road, the good one, and it's probably a German seat. And I don't know, there is like that thing thrown over there, this thing. I don't know what this is, this stuff here, that small place. Uh, also, I saw a chair thrown out here. It's uh, quite dirty, this is another thing there is a hole here okay I'm staying or something yeah you just find weird things up here and there is a sign to go around this thing yeah looks like a, a small place in which uh, either people or animals in the past were sleeping. Yeah, anyway, I was expecting actually to find the homeless in this uh, thing, but... Uh, nope. And I love these rocks with uh, moss over there. Now the weird thing is that I'm going downhill a lot. It's uh, something is weird. Then I probably go uphill again. <laughs> and the road is split now. Splits. 
between Runtur and Runtur, so going here or you just take around around the mountain and here is the main road actually and uh, yeah it's a nature reservation natur reservater welcome so it's called Enli Enli OEC blev upprättet i Hernholsvis 1982 och 2005 bägge reservaten är ah okay so it's two uh, reservation uh, reservations is not only one because uh, it said bägge two so uh, I don't know what will be the frontier between uh, both of them but uh, what's important is that it's a nature reservation it should be clean I should keep it clean I don't I'm not allowed to uh, take down any plant or do any shit like that so everything should be clean and nice which it seems like it is for now and this is exactly what I was saying going up here a lot and it continues this way This place looks like a chance for a great view if I can get on this rock safely. This is a deer third. So they are preferring to have a nice toilet in this place. I would do too. If I was there, I see a few horses down there. <laughs> very, very interesting. Now, help me with this one. So, I'm on the right road. My app says go this way. There is also a sign on the tree. But right now, I get to this place. Okay, I can uh, go on this one. And this is the fucking trail I have to follow. Uh, and I saw there on <coughs> on this tree on exact <coughs> right here there is another sign so this is the road so there probably was a forest uh, incident or accident or whatever because of a lot of snow or the rain and these uh, rocks probably slipped over on each other and the trees and now the trail. Let's uh, try this so-called hiking trail. It shouldn't be that hard. I mean, it looks worse than it is, I think. Because these rocks, hopefully they are as stable as they look. Okay, this is the sign I was uh, telling you about. Whew. This is a bit harder. It's still easy, so considering I can even film this, it's possible. But look at this. Lovely. Yeah, these forest fruits are so motherfucking tasty. Full of flavor. Okay, now we are talking. This is a trail. <laughs> you 
yeah, it looks like it was uh, actually a problem here with the rocks falling down. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see in the next part of this road. Till then, another view is not getting easier. I have to pass by this tree, which dropped right here. Ah. I'll be under it. Okay. New place, new problem. So I have to go this way, but I'm thinking of maybe if I'm just doing it around somehow because it doesn't look like a river, more like a pond right there. Uh, yeah. Oh, look, fruits. Hey, happy! I found this stream of water, this spring. It's very nice, makes me so thirsty. So it comes from both sides. So probably maybe the... Maybe it's actually coming from under this rock here. It's very nice. I'd like to touch the water, clean my face maybe, if I can grab a oh, so clean, clean and nice. This place doesn't look like a normal trail and uh, it actually makes me a little bit scared uh, somehow I don't know what it can be between all these uh, plants snakes or bugs I don't know uh, but uh, I'm just in the middle of this I have to continue that way somehow maybe I go on top right there I'm not sure I have to pass this tree I put my backpack wrongly I think I thought it might uh, help me to have it here, but I'll just have it there. Okay. Okay. That worked well. Yeah, but... Uh, Okay, this is a little bit better back then, it was uh, just grass, so it's uh, more scary when uh, you don't see anything down, so you don't know if you're stepping on anything. I can uh, give you a little story from my childhood. I was about 16, I was biking through the forest. And uh, I don't know if you know, but there is uh, this type of uh, bees that are making their hives uh, on the ground. So I step on one of those and uh, all of them attacked me. I, I got bitten a few times. Yeah. Let's hope it's not the case here. It is very beautiful, no doubt. But this makes me very stressed. This is another unsafe to walk place and my trail should be above these rocks right here. Uh, maybe I should just get back, continue on this way somehow. Hmm. Yeah, so I have to get on top of those and hopefully there will be a normal 
hiking trail. <laughs> this way. My app is weird many times. This might be one of these times. Uh, I should have enough time to do this hike during uh, daytime and also I was planning to go to swim. But uh, it depends. <laughs> this road becomes heavier and heavier. Yeah, but as I said, it's very beautiful, it's just... So there is water going down there. Yeah, I guess this is the actual trail. <laughs> but where does it go? No sign on the trees or anything. It goes like this, I saw. So I have no idea how my application gets it's data. Oh look, this looks like a trail people have passed through. Yeah, feels a little bit better, but it goes wilder <laughs> in front of me right there. Anyway, I managed to find a few of this. Ah, no way. Lost two of them. Got them back. Yeah, so there is no way of getting around this place. So it's either all in. Okay, ah, okay. I thought this would be mold, but there is another step. Okay, this is mold. Uh, I'm not sure if I can. I mean, I can jump to that spot, but uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to slip over. Okay, I'm just uh, checking different spots. Uh, anyway, I'm already a little bit uh, wet with my socks, so... <coughs> yeah, that worked out, but I uh, got my full shoe. Uh, full of water right now. Uh, yeah, I came uh, unprepared. Uh, that's fine. The weather is really good, so I shouldn't uh, get any cold or anything like that. Everything should be okay. Just a little bit uncomfortable to walk with my feet wet. Look at this. There is sunshine and flowers. <laughs> and now back into the forest. So it's like it was not enough we saw a fully black one, but this is a fully white one. An albino. What the fuck? This is unbelievably special, I'm, I'm not lying. And another one. Oh, fuck. This is a very big issue actually, because it continues like this. So I just try to go there and I back off because it's just like this. Uh, this moss is filled with water. So stepping on it uh, makes me go down. I'm just looking if I can maybe go around it because i was just looking at the map and it continues like this for a while it's uh, there is this dotted map with uh, special places and this one starts here and continues as i said i'm anyway like in the middle of nowhere without any signs on the trees that it should be a trail here or no so i'm just uh, using my weird app so maybe, but even going there, it feels so hard. And, oh my God, I hate that I have to do this. 
but uh, yeah, I don't want to put myself in danger or anything. It's a little bit weird continuing that way. It's also yeah a little bit late. So as I said, uh, it's half past eight. It's fine. It will be light until eleven to see at least where I step. But uh, no, because it, it would have continued like that for at least 500 meters, which is a lot to go through a pond for 500 meters without protection over my feet. So sadly, I will get back, but this will uh, give me a different perspective on the same road seeing this from this side not from that side it should be should be okay should be nice i still have to pass above two or three ponds like this but they are just one step to safety -ness. so that's okay yeah, so uh, continuing back. Back to her.